So for shoulder flexion three, this is for the patient who has uh, range of motion above 90 degrees and pretty good control of the side to side motion of the arm. So it is actively using the muscles of the arm more than some of the other directions for shoulder flexion. So go ahead and have a seat right here. We want to position the pulley so it's just above the affected shoulder, in this case her right shoulder. And then we're going to have her hold on to the handle with her right hand in her lap. And then we'll bring this down so that you can just reach up with the left hand. And now again, we want you to completely relax the right arm, elbow, wrist. The only thing holding on are your fingers. And then gently pulling down with the left hand, raising the right arm up as far as you can comfortably go. Keeping the arm in the sagittal plane or directly in the hand directly in front of the shoulder. And if you run out of room with your left hand, you can adjust the length of this handle. Go ahead and let that one down to your lap. We'll make this one a little, there you go, can reach it. And then bring in your arm up and you can get your arm up a little bit higher. Normal or full range of motion of the shoulder into flexion would be to have your hand come all the way back and touch the door. But work through the pain limited range of motion where it does not increase your pain. Do 15 to 30 repetition or as many as it takes for you to feel like you get a, your shoulder loosened up. And that's shoulder flexion three.